Hi friends, welcome to my channel. My name is Mary Grace and I do know how to swim, but I can't breathe underwater. Today we are continuing on with Percy Jackson and the Olympians, season one, episode five. We are officially in the second half of season one. This episode is called A God Buys Us Cheeseburgers. We have been waiting for this scene for Waterland to be brought to life for so long. I am more excited for this episode than any other episode so far. And we left on a cliffhanger last time, so we're just gonna get right into it because I, I, I don't wanna wait anymore. I wanna just watch. Honestly, like, there might be moments where like, people will have to like check my pulse, see if I'm okay because <sighs> I don't know what they're gonna give us. And I'm so excited and I'm so nervous. I don't think I'm gonna be okay. <laughs> Back in the river. Or is he coming? He's coming out the river. Okay. Oh, look at the explosion. Oh my god. This is not good. I was wondering if we were gonna get this because we didn't hear anything about it beforehand. Annabeth's the one seeing them. <gasps> Annabeth's the one seeing the fates. What? That's crazy. Come on. Let's go find Percy. Annabeth. He's alive. Yes. Grover, don't you doubt our boy. Percy! Are they seeing him? Are they finding him? Hey! Are you okay? <laughs> hi. Hi. Yeah, hi. That's it. I'm sorry about shoving you in the stairwell. Even hearing myself say that sounds really bad, but I just, I knew you'd never agree, and there wasn't enough time. Yeah, she wouldn't have been able to survive that. Hug her back, Percy. What are you doing? He literally saved all three of you by doing that. We need to go to Santa Monica. <laughs> what, like now? My father's gonna meet me there. He's gonna help us. Who's got sudden faith in his godly parent now? The police think that we crashed an Amtrak train and then did that. Ooh. Isn't that gonna make it hard for us to get on a train? Yes. Or a bus? Yes. Or really anything you need tickets for? Yes. Are they looking for all three of them? Or are they just looking for Percy? Because they got an invisibility cap. Maybe when we started, my head wasn't fully in this, but since the river, it all feels different somehow. Because you know your dad cares about you? Why are you being weird with me again? I thought we weren't doing that anymore. I'm not being weird. Yes, you are. You've been weird since we left the arch. Because of her mom. Yeah. It doesn't have to be a thing, you know? They hug me. <laughs> Percy. Oh, 12-year-old boys. I saw the fates. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Why did that leave my brain? I saw the three fates, and I saw Atropus cut a piece of thread. When you see a string cut... It means one of us is going to die. We're all gonna die, actually. Soon. <laughs> it's a warning. An omen. Need some help? <gasps> we don't want anything from you. <laughs> you sure? Because you guys are so behind schedule. <laughs> Why am I, like, immediately terrified the second that he's on screen? I mean, summer solstice is just a few days away. And as much as I'd love to see a good war pop off, as your big cousin, I feel like maybe I want to give you a hand. Aries. You must be Athena's kid. Always got to be the wisest one in the bunch. It's not really by choice. Listen, dummies, I'm hungry. There's a halfway decent diner up the road. If you want my help, you'll meet me there. But don't dawdle. Won't wait forever. You'll meet me there? <laughs> oh, Percy, not the question to ask. You don't have the time to answer that question. <laughs> we've got like, <laughs> we've got five more books in this series and then another whole series. So your quest is going to fail. Ask me how I know. It isn't going to fail. <laughs> sure it is. <laughs> For starters. Percy was always <laughs> trouble. Freaking Gabe. He looks so slimy. Whether the bolts retrieved or not, Zeus is going to war with Poseidon. That's not good. No. The Oracle said if we returned the bolt, there wouldn't be a war. Is that what she said? 
Or is that what Chiron said she meant? Olympians fight. We betray. We backstab. We will push anyone down a flight of stairs to get it. Whoa. Hey. My dad knows he's not getting this bolt back with quests or goose chases. He knows there's a war coming. And in reality, I think he's okay with that. I think he feels it's just time for a war. So we're gonna have a war. You want the war because you're Aries. There's an amusement park up the road. I left my shield there. You get me my shield back and I'll get you to the underworld by lunch tomorrow with a plan to invade Hades' palace. You left your shield? Like, forgot on the merry-go-round? <laughs> she is so sassy! Okay, the chirping was funny to me for a minute, but it is getting old. Iconic. Okay. Great. And catch. <laughs> I really do need that shield back. So I'm gonna keep the satyr here as collateral. So you don't <gasps> no. Like, no. Okay. We don't split up. Again. Yeah. It's okay. No. If you wanted to kill us, we'd be dead by now. Yeah, but he could still kill you later. I don't like that Grover's not going with them. <gasps> Welcome to Waterland. I haven't seen a lot of horror movies, but this seems like exactly the kind of place this is just to avoid. Yeah. Oh, it's so I've never cool. seen any kind of movie. I'll have to take your word for it. Never. She's been at camp since she was seven. Neither of us is dead in a few days. We really ought to fix that. Aww. Wait, Percy, stop. <gasps> okay, what just happened? What? Just, just hold still. In the mechanism there. That celestial bronze. If you're a human, it'll pass right through you. If you're a monster or a demigod. It'll eat ya. A god built this. What kind of god builds amusement parks? Mm. How fast? Yep. Push through it. Push? Yep. Okay. Because weren't you the one this morning who saw the fate say one of us is going to die? Seriously? Percy? <laughs> yeah? Just push. Okay, just push. Fingers crossed. One, huh. Okay, two. Is that what I was waiting for? Two, because it's supposed to be, because it's supposed to be Ares and uh, his girlfriend, Aphrodite. I'm a fan. Girlfriend, what are you doing? The satyrs eat tofu. Satyrs worship flowers. Satyrs sing songs about their feelings. Satyrs are not fans of mine. Sounds like I'm a satyr. Nature is brutal. Red and tooth and claw, right? Maybe unpleasant, but that doesn't make it untrue. You are the champion. All of that. I respect Grover, you. what are you doing? I prefer the turbot war. The lobster war. The 335 years war. I like your mellower stuff. <laughs> There's something cool about overwhelming force and a quick surrender. No one talks about those anymore. They should. Grover is a genius. I don't even know what he's playing at right now, but I know it's smart. Thrill right on! Don't you even try to tell me not to be worried about this. <laughs> Facts. This must be where Ares and Aphrodite got caught. The shield must be in there. Let's go check out the scary ghost ride. Why not? It's happening. This just doesn't seem like a fun ride. Where's the thrill? Where's the love? What is love? <laughs> there it is. <laughs> this is incredible. I know this. What is the story they're projecting? This is a story. Okay. Projected by Hera, projected by Aphrodite. My mom told me these stories all the time. I remember this. She said this is what the gods are like to each other. Hmm. She was trying to keep me away from you guys. Maybe she should have been preparing me better. Maybe she was preparing you. Yeah. So when you got to us, you'd be different than this. Yeah. <gasps> Sally Jackson, again. Oh, I need a ride. I need a ride. Why does this Loki look like Splash Mountain? 
Hello? There it is. There is shield. Oh, I don't like any of what's happening here. This is all bad. <laughs> no. Okay, Annabeth, you good? We don't know how she is in the water. <gasps> oh no. Oh, what is happening? Ooh. Hello? What just happened? Is she okay? Did you just pull me out of there with that water power stuff? Looks like it. How do they get that? Get that thing down. Yeah. I don't like that. The peacock feathers. It's giving Hera. It's a machine, but how do you start the machine? Look at the cogs in the back. But as soon as she sat in it, she couldn't get up. All the gods tried, but the machine was too smart. It was too strong. It was too much. Even for them. I'm nervous. I don't like this. One of us goes in, the other gets the shield. I'll do it. What? Wait a minute. Whoever goes in isn't coming out. That seems pretty clear. I know, that's why I said wait. This isn't the arch seaweed brain. <laughs> you're not pushing me into the stairwell yet. Yes, I am. I'm not gonna let you this time. It doesn't work that way. It's why you're here. <gasps> I told Chiron I needed someone who wouldn't hesitate to sacrifice me if the quest required. <sighs> Freaking out. So much is happening right now. We dodged at the arch, barely, but maybe this isn't something you can dodge forever. The Oracle chose you. The gods chose Stop. you. Stop. It isn't about that. What could it possibly be about if it isn't about that? You're better at this than me. You just are. And you know it. How is this? How is. How. how what? You just see me braid and then you do this and then you do and no what? <laughs> and now he's giving her riptide? I can't handle this. I can't handle this. Oh my god. I need you to promise me something. Okay, yes, forever. What? I'm not leaving the underworld without your mom. Oh, they're already best friends. I was gonna say when this quest is done, can you maybe swing back here and try to get me out of this thing? <laughs> you think you had to ask? I'm dying. I'm dying. I'm dying. If this is who that I don't think I can make it through five seasons if this is where we're starting. This is weird. Warm. It's warm? What does that mean? Is that a good thing or a bad thing? I don't know. Oh, what is this? Oh, I don't like it. This is a bad idea. Stand up. I can't. Percy, stand up. I mean it's it. It's okay. No. I'm okay. No, 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 no. Oh my god. Am I gonna cry? What just happened? What just happened? Okay, now how do you get him out? We kind of need him. Yeah, okay, good. Annabeth, you gotta figure this out. You gotta figure this out, babe. She is so smart, she can do this. This is the closest I've come to crying so far in this series. Hi, Hephaestus. Can I help you? Yeah, you can get him out of, stop being a gold statue boy. So, off you go. Uh-uh. No, no, no. Sorry. I'm not leaving without my friend. Yep. Yeah, that isn't really how it works. It's kind of a one-way sort of thing. It can't be undone. Well, it's gonna be undone. How do you know? Because I built it. Ooh, I like his beard and mustache. Pretty please let him out? I know your mother was displeased with you recently, but this was a lot. Even for her. You walk out of here with that shield, you're a hero on your way to the greatest glory. That's not, no. And I'll go back to being as it always has been. Always will be, as it should be. It isn't how it should be. It isn't. Eat or be eaten. Power and glory and nothing else matters. Ares is that way. 
Zeus is that way. My mother is that way. She won't be that way. Percy's he not. Isn't that way? Yeah, Percy's not that way. He's better than that. Yes, because of Sally. Maybe I was that way once, but I don't want to be that way anymore. <gasps> I won't be like all of you. <gasps> I just won't. Oh my God. I am not okay. I don't think I will ever be okay. Knowing that this is where it starts with them. Hi, Percy! Oh, oh my god. Oh my god. Oh. Hi. Oh. So still like being that way either. Good job, Hephaestus. I'll put in a good word with your mom for you. Okay, Percy, now you need to hug her. Because that could have ended way differently for you, my friend. I'm having heart palpitations. <laughs> He's like, how'd they live? Stinky, stinky Aries. I feel like I haven't taken a breath in the last 25 minutes. This thing is going to be at the Lotus Casino in Vegas. Hermes hangs out there. You play your cards right, and his personal driver can get you to L.A. in a minute. Close, cash, drachmas to summon Hermes. Your dad had plenty of kids he stopped caring about once he lost interest. We're not gonna fail. I'm getting pretty tired of you saying it. Percy, <laughs> you think you know who I am, but you don't. I mean, facts. I'm careful. You're gonna find out. Honestly, it was smart of Grover to stay behind because now he's, like, kind of in with him. Assuming Ares was telling the truth. He wasn't. Not entirely, at any rate. He was holding something back. Mm-hmm. I think I got it out of him. <gasps> I know who stole the Master Bowl. We're figuring it out now? That was the best episode so far. And I'm not saying that just because of Persebeth. It has a lot to do with that. <laughs> but like, this was the best episode by far. I'm so excited to see where everything goes from here. Grover was like playing mind games with Ares and ev oh my god, like I literally Waterland was, look, it was different from the books, but it was so good. It was so good. Oh my god. To see the relationship that has grown between Percy and Annabeth so far, like, already, I, I will not be able to handle five seasons. I, I need them. I will not be able to handle if I don't get five seasons. But like, I literally will be on the floor, comatose, absolutely dead, un unable to be revived. Like, <laughs> it was so, it's so good. And it's chef's kisses all around. One thing that I've really loved throughout this whole series so far, and I think it was shown the most in this episode, uh, like in the last episode and this episode, was how much depth we already have in our trio, in Percy, Annabeth, and Grover. Like, we really got to see so much more of them and like their personalities and like the things that make them tick, their fatal flaws, their like, their, like the way that their minds work. Like we're seeing so much more of that as the season progresses and it's so much fun and it's so interesting and incredible and I love it. I love it so much. I feel like they've already grown so much as characters. We've already seen so much depth like to who they are as people. Like depth that I feel like we didn't get until like later on in the book series. So I'm so excited to see where it goes from here and like how it leads into the later series 
uh, like the later seasons of the series. Thank you guys so much for hanging out with me and watching this episode of Percy Jackson and the Olympians. I had so much fun. I hope you guys had fun watching me freak out and not know what to do with myself during the entirety of that Waterland scene because oh my god. Oh my god. <laughs> I will leave all of the previous reactions of our Percy Jackson watch along series down below. I will also leave uh, all of my social medias if you want to follow me outside of there. You can also subscribe down below if you want to join me on the journey of watching the rest of this season. I'm so excited. I'm so excited. I'm so excited. Can you tell? Have I mentioned that I'm excited? <laughs> All right, I love you guys. I hope you guys all have a wonderful day wherever you are, and I will see you next time for even more Percy Jackson and the Olympians. Bye.